and tell a lot of men about stuff they didn't even know was wrong at the end of the day. I feel like, and the thing I noticed about the place was a lot of men that were mentioned on those days were men that we knew as, oh, they got so many girls, oh, they did this, they did that. But what we didn't know was behind closed doors, they were forcing themselves on these girls and making them uncomfortable, which is the number, like, I feel like that's something we need to teach people. We need to teach people to understand that you can't make people uncomfortable. Your own comfort or the other person around this comfort should always be in mind when you're doing stuff. In terms of cat calling, roping, these are things that happen in Nigeria that nobody talks about. My, my sister walked across the street, maybe 50 meters, and she got cat called over 10 times. I wasn't with her, but this is her own account, but over 10 times. Every day, I walked down this street, every day, morning and night, to go catch my, my staff bus. I've never been spoken to, I've never been harassed, nothing's ever happened to me, because I'm a man. And it's always men doing this type of stuff to women, making them uncomfortable, making them feel like it's unsafe to even exist which is horrible and this is why we gotta hold our men accountable so that the world can feel safe for everybody which it should. Mm -hmm.